Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Minecraft, and today I finally fixed my- Oh, good golly. Sorry about that, you guys. I had to move my mic. My mic was way too far off from my face. So I fixed my computer. It was just the power supply unit, or PSU. I upgraded to a Corsair 650M. Yeah, CX650M. That's what I upgraded to. Um, I honestly don't remember the old brand. It was like a cheap- Chinese knockoff brand I believe that I'd gotten for $35 but I had bought a few of them uh, when I was building my friend's computer and uh, they had sent me like a bunch of them so yeah so I don't really recommend going with whatever brand that is I might put them down in the description just to watch out but today we are working on the blast furnace. Now, the blast yeah. furnace is from what? Industrial engineering? Immersive engineering, yeah. Sure, if you want to call it that. I've heard it both ways. <laughs> <laughs> so this um, goes right along with the coal coke oven from the same mod. And the difference between the coal co or the coke oven and this new blast furnace is the coke oven makes coal coke and the blast furnace makes steel. So we're gonna be having a lot of steel making. Now I saw somebody earlier that said that they made 18 stacks of it. So that is a lot. Of yeah, but eventually we're gonna have an improved furnace which is automated and stuff. But for now it's just stupid and boring. Yeah, so I worked uh, earlier today. I just kind of boosted up our smeltery drain. Oh, server restart in 10 Ripped. minutes. All right, well we can do this one quick little thing real fast and let's do this all right so the blast furnace what do we need we need blast brick blast brick is right here and so it takes a block of coal coke so we need nine coal coke or coal coke to make the block of coal coke do we have that are you smelting that down? Coal coke? no it's in the drawers i i made a stack of it earlier okay so we need to make what nine of these Mm -hmm. Okay, so I, we created these two different project tables. This is for the better barrels stuff. This is just kind of some random stuff, so we're going to put that away. Um, I'm going to see, so I can make one block of that. Let's just go ahead and see. So I can make I can make eight blocks. I need three more coal coke. Three more. We're limited on time, you guys. Uh, looks like, do we need more fuel or something in here? In what? In the coal coke, or in the coke oven? No, it, it runs on itself. Oh. It's just, it's just very, very slow. Is there any way to speed it up? Um, there's an improved furnace, I think, but other than that, no. Uh. See, look at that. Coke. I need two more. <laughs> Dude, they're, like, how much do you need? I need two more pieces. Because you need like you need nine blocks of it. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. So then it looks like okay. So we need twenty-seven of it. So we need um eighteen bricks, right? Because we need to make nine. Yep. So we need eighteen bricks. Do we have eighteen bricks. We've got five. <laughs> I think uh, we have six. Okay. So that means we need what? Twelve more. So I have four more clay here. So I've I've got four. Uh, oh, I grabbed two stacks so, of it. In the meantime, while you're doing that, I'll just work on the kiln, which is pretty simple. So what is the? Oh, is that that other thing? Yeah, it's the alloy kiln. Oh my gosh! For those that don't know, it essentially works like the smeltery, except it runs on solid fuel, and you can't pour things out of it. You just alloy stuff. It's ba yeah, it's like the um, huche de scuche. Um, I'll just melt down a stack of netherrack, or not a stack, a half a stack of netherrack just in case. Um, just go ahead and eat this loaf of bread. So he's just gonna work on a quick kiln, which I can actually show you. How long does it take to eat a loaf of bread? Um, so he is working on this mod here, Al. Alo alloy. Um, so he's just gonna make a quick one of these. So you make a two by two by two, and he's gonna just see what he can make with that. Um, and then we are working on this. So what else do we need for the blast brick? We need 
a bunch of blaze rods. So we've got all 18 that we need. And so we need four, so this should make 36. All right, so we got 36 blaze powder, which is nice. Looks like we have actually 38. Um, so we've got this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just kind of set up a quick little um, thing so that way we know how much we have. So basically why I have the three crafting tables and a chest in here is so that way we can, oh, and this mod's kind of weird. It'll allow some upgrades, but it's like not all there. I think they took out the majority of the mod. Um, so what this allows me to do is have three different projects going or three of the same type of thing. So if I have to craft like a barrel per se, I have to craft a copper chest, a gold chest, or a copper chest, an iron chest, and a silver chest. So I can have however many copper chests in here, however many iron chests, and however many silver chests. So that way I can just make my chests all into one and then I can just go ahead and craft it. It just makes it a little bit simpler. That's my personal take on it. If you guys ever use the project tables from Project Red, those are this is kind of a different take on it. How much time do we have left until the server restarts? Have they said? Uh, it gives us warnings. I haven't seen a five-minute thing. Okay. Okay. So are you just gonna like? Are we keeping going? Gonna keep going after it, or are we? No. Are we gonna we're edit gonna, it out? We're gonna end it right before. Oh. Okay. We're gonna see if we can. Ten-minute episode. Yeah. Oh, I need one more. Piece of cold coke. This is this is grueling. Okay, that's our five minute mark. Let's see if we can do this. We might actually have to edit this out if we don't have enough time, you guys. Um, so we've got our bricks here and we've got what? What? Don't take my clay. It's my bricks. Oh, sorry. Mine's the bottom one. Yeah. Alright. Uh looks like we ran out of fuel. So I need, I'll just take a stack, throw that in there. And so if I remember it's these and then that, no, that is all traded. Okay, so I'm just gonna split that evenly, split that evenly as best as we can. And I've made nine blast brick. So we, we still need some more, we're good on blaze, powder we need one more block of coal and we need more brick and more nether brick so I'll grab more of this and I don't ever recommend shifting anything in here because if it's wood it'll just automatically go into the fuel I don't know what the fuel is for I think it's for furnaces because you can put furnaces in here I don't ever recommend doing that though just because this mod is really glitchy even though that it's a pretty cool mod um, I just would say watch out for that. All right, let's grab more nether rack, nether brick. Can we not access the same stuff? What do you mean? Like, okay, I'm in this workshop table. Oh, hey, you finished that mod. Can you access this project ta or this uh, table over here that I'm looking at while I'm in here? I'm in it right now. Do you see me moving around stuff? Yeah. Okay. So I guess it's just Tinker's Construct. So if you guys are working with somebody on this mod pack and on this server, it does not work to be in the same Tinker's Construct stuff. It's really annoying. Yeah. Are you building the kiln back there? Yeah. Oh. Oops. Do you have the engineer's hammer? No, I don't. I can go get it though. Dun dun dun. Come on. Give it to me. What? What? It's gone. You broke it? Yeah, it's gone. Good job. Good job. Huh. Well, that's interesting. It's probably just like server lag or something. Yeah. Well, oh, no, it's here. It replaced my oh, sword okay. for whatever reason. It just. Okay, that's, that's a cool game. Alright, you ready? Ba bam! And now we have the alloy kiln. Epic. It just runs on like coal or coal cloak and you can alloy metals. Yeah. Alright. So, okay, do we have two minutes? Let's see if we can do it. Let's see if we you can, can do, do it. it. What? Four, one, two, one, two. Okay. Now I need more netherrack? Question mark. 
four, four. Okay, I just need that one last thing of coal, coke. It's 20, oh, we got it. All right, so it looks like we can even finish it up before the, the last little bit. All right, so we're gonna put that there, get our coal coke block, we're gonna do this, get all 27 blast brick, and we should do detect and claim. So now we got our eight steel ingots, and we finally completed this quest. Now, if we look in the actual quest book, this now should allow us to start some other mods, and now we have to make a conveyor belt, and we will do that in the next video. All right, you making the uh, hole? But so we'll show you guys how we can actually kind of use this to make steel, hopefully, if we have enough time. Otherwise, I can just edit it in. One minute, speed build. And ba bam. All right. So in here, it looks like you put your iron ingots up here and your coal coke, uh, coke. down here. Yeah. Or yeah, your coke. Um, and then <laughs> we're not drug dealers here, I promise. Uh, <laughs> and then this makes whatever byproduct down here, and it makes your steel ingot there. I don't know if this actually can make anything else. No, it's just used for steel, literally. Alright, but that'll be it for this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to check out my uh, social medias down below, and I will catch you guys next time. Make sure to also join my Discord server, and that'll be it. So I will catch you guys in my next video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe one last time, and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye